That's why the National Weather Service has declared this week Winter Weather Awareness Week, so you can be prepared before the snow starts to fly. Today's key focus, the difference between winter storm watches and warnings. Our 18 Storm Team meteorologist Anna Myers joins us with a look at those definitions. It's Winter Weather Awareness Week in New York State, and in honor of the week, we're going to talk about some of the things you need to know ahead of the upcoming winter season, such as what's the difference between watches, warnings, and advisories, and what are the common ones we see here in New York State? A watch is issued when a storm is in its early stage of development and may create conditions that could harm life or property. A warning is issued when a threat to life and property is imminent or has already begun for severe winter weather. And advisories are less serious weather conditions that won't cause immediate threats, but it's issued when it could impact motorists, outdoor activities, or public events. Snow squall warning is issued when we're going to see snowfall of over two inches or more per hour, and our visibility is less than a quarter mile for 15 to 30 minutes at least. A few of the watches, warnings, and advisories we see here are dealing with wind chill watches or wind chill advisories, winter storm watch or winter storm warnings, winter weather advisories, and ice storm warnings. Now those are just some of the few watches, warnings, and advisories we commonly see here in New York State when dealing with winter weather. From Elmira, I'm Anna Myers, 18 News.